Tell me get that motherfucking camera out my face. Can't do this all time, man. Why the fuck you wanna film? You ain't got nothing to film. You got rail in this bitch. Gang, gang. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey man, uh, go ahead and tell them what you get, what you been working on, man. I just seen a motherfucking uh, video clip. Yeah, yeah. On your IG, dropped, we just dropped "Walk with Me" uh, off our different struggles, same dreams. Me and my brother King Dino, we dropped that shit uh, January. We just dropped a single for "Walk with Me." It's the hit single. We we going up on Spotify and motherfucking SoundCloud. Mm -hmm. we catch that. We catch it on YouTube, all the major platforms on Title Two. So yeah, that's, that's what it is right now. And we about to uh. I'm about to release my solo joint soon. I'm about to release a single uh, called No More Mr. Nice Guy. That motherfucker about to bang. I got, I got everything coming up, man. What's up? What's yeah. up He's like, I got everything coming up, man. <laughs> How long you been doing music? Uh, Seriously, I'd say three years, three, four years. I've been writing and doing like singing and shit and poetry and shit since I was like 14, 13. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But rap, like, probably good. Three, four years. So who'd you start initially making music with? Uh, uh I would say probably with HQ. You said probably with probably. HQ. That's like, what's up, yeah. man. H, H really taught me how to like structure my shit. You know what I'm saying? I was man. just spitting. You know what I'm saying? When you first started spitting, most likely you rambling. You know what I'm saying? You just going on and on and on. There's no first verse hook. Second verse, you know what I'm saying? But it don't always necessarily have to be there. It could be bridges and what whatnot. But that came later. But H taught me how to initially get like the fundamentals, you would say. So, of, uh, so how how is your your style switched from like nowadays from back in the day? Do you rap different? Do you is it different kind of beats you use now or different kind of flow? Um, definitely. All three of those you said, <laughs> beat, flow, everything that changed. Mm -hmm. Cause at first I was, I was really trying to like say shit and like have a message and trying to, you know what I mean? I was thinking too much. Now like, I listen to the beat and let it speak to me. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Then I speak. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't try to like. Yeah, listen. back in the day, for you, for you to be, you know, a, a younger generation rapper. Back in the day, you was spitting a lot of conscious. Yeah, a lot of, a lot of. It, it wasn't even like conscious. I would say it was more like conceptual, like like concepts and con. Like nowadays, nobody got concepts. It's just like whatever come to your head, spit. And I fuck with that because like the pure vibe of the moment. You know what I'm saying? That's what it's about. Mm -hmm. And once I captured that flow, now that's what I do. And shit. And now I like I like more. Uh, I call them soulful bangers, like shit with samples, but they got like eight oh eights and you know what I'm saying, mm -hmm. up to high hats and you know what I'm saying, trap trap bass and shit. So like you that. still you still give them a message, just you know. Yeah, I still give them a message, but make them want to listen to it more. It's street conscious. That's what I call it. I call it street conscious. You know what I'm saying? Street conscious. Or uh, I flip side and I, I spit to to. To the ladies and shit, and I call it smooth player shit. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Smooth hip type music. You know what I'm saying? Like shit like that. But that shit, me and my brother King Vino was curating. And that's what we did with with different drugs, same dreams. Like we came. So who shot in. that one? Huh? Who oh, shot the, the video to walk, for Walk with Me, y'all films. Shout out to y'all film. He mm -hmm. shot that shit. We shot it downtown, right when Indy 500 weekend. So it was, it was nice. It was real nice. That's what's up, man. It looked lit. It looked lit. Huh? I said it look lit. Yeah, 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 that shit motherfucker was lit. I know y'all got some behind the scenes. Yeah, yeah, we got some shit on IG, at the real radio. We got a lot, a lot, of, a lot of content on my hostile youth life page, highlight page. We got a lot of shit on there. But, but we trying, we trying to push the videos. I got, I got a few videos that's that's cooking. One with you. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Few. There's a lot of people in the, in the city. There's a lot of talent in the city. 4K Rose, goddammit. Y'all yeah. go follow him. Uh, Y'all go follow uh, uh, Russo Fuego. You know what I'm saying? Just so down. It, yeah, just down. Y'all had a group, right? Y'all yeah. still, is it still an active group or? It's not, just we, we don't focus on We don't solo. call ourselves a group no more. It's really just like, a label. when we come, yeah, when we come together, we come together. You uh, know what I'm saying? Like, y'all do a label thing, you know what I mean? It's not, let's yeah, say the group, but y'all rock out. 
the, in the same faction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Should I say? Y'all still high life? Yeah, it's, it's like it's like Wu Tang, man. You know what I'm saying? When ODB did his thing, <laughs> when ODB did his thing, he wasn't. Uh, he ain't fucking with Wu Tang no more. He's just ODB. They all had their own separate contracts when they came to the game. You know what I mean? Met the man. What? He was signed to uh, EMI or some shit. I don't know. I forgot. But they, they, they all signed they, a different they, thing. They was all but still, different things. You know what different things, management, different deals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shit like but that. But it was all Wu Tang. That's how we rock it. You know what I'm saying?